Hello and welcome to our second feature focus. This time we'll be focusing on slots and squads, and of course by extension the troopers that are contained within them. Slots and squads are pretty much containers for the objects that will do most of the fighting on planets for you, the troopers. Slots contain slots and squads, while squads can only contain troopers. Here we can see our force organisation screen, which allows us to organise our force however we want. Slots and squads pretty much just give us easy grabbing points for choosing what troopers we want to take where and what actions we want to do with them. Once we're viewing the inside of a squad, we can see all the troopers and what makes up its contents. From here we can easily pick out new equipment, organise colours, organise different patterns, we can see all the strengths and the weaknesses of our trooper, every statistic and trait they have. Every single trooper is an individual, they have their very own statistics and up to two traits which can make them stand out from everyone else. These traits can be modded, as can much of the gear and equipment, so you can add your own unique flavour to the game. As your troopers fight and hopefully win battles across the sector, they will gain experience. Some of your troopers will indicate strong leadership abilities, and these troopers should slowly be promoted as they gain experience into lieutenant, captain or higher ranks to provide bonuses for all the troopers in their command, which basically means in their slot. Your squad and slot leaders will play a unique role in combat, organising and commanding your force for you on the battlefield, so make sure you pick your command as well. That's all we have time for today, so like and follow if you want to keep up to date with development and see more feature focuses. You can find us on Instagram and Facebook, links are in the description. Good luck Generals!